Hey guys, what's going on? It's your boy Troy, and thank you for coming back to the channel. This is the channel where we usually grind for the money and you know leverage our income, but in today's video, I gotta get on my grind to get back to making videos, okay? My computer died on me, so what we're gonna do today is build a new computer as we see right here. So I got all the parts that we need. Let's get to work. But before we get to work, I just want to introduce you to my roommate, because he's gonna help me. My boy Armando right here. <laughs> Say hello to the people. How's it going, guys? <laughs> but anyway, all right, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to build this computer up real quick. And um, listen, for all the tech heads out there, if I butcher this, don't come at me. Don't, don't kill me for this, all right? I enjoy doing this. I, actually, I built a computer about 10 years ago. And that's the computer that just finished dying on me. So this is a brand new start for me. And um, I'm a little rusty. So like I said, for those who are tech geniuses out there, don't cringe when you watch the video, all right? Just enjoy it and have fun. So let's get started. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start on with the mother motherboard right now. The type of motherboard that I have is the MCI Lightning Gen. It's a gaming plus type motherboard, so it's the first time I open it up. This is fun. It's like an unboxing slash fake tutorial slash get your life together, right? So I don't conduct electricity. For now, we're going to throw some rubber gloves on so we don't... We don't destroy anything. We don't want any of that static shock hitting that motherboard right now, right? So. Where are you going? So I got old parts and newer parts. So uh, for the most part, most of everything new, but what I'm carrying from the old computer is going to be two of my RAM chips from uh, Corsair The Vengeance, right? And then I got my, my terabyte hard drive that I'm going to install in this after I put the solid state drive in it, SSD drive in it, right? That's also a terabyte. So I have Two terabytes of um, two pair two terabytes of hard drive space on it, and for now I'm gonna use the older GPU that my friend gave me, okay? And it's actually a MSI GPU, and the motherboard is MSI, so we you know we're gonna keep the keep it in the family a little bit here today. But as for my new parts, well for one before I even get to a part, I got the I fix it, okay? I know y'all know what that is for the tech people out here. Y'all know what I fix it is. Okay, so I'm gonna use this to basically handle all the screw screwing in the uh, system right here. Voila, got everything you need right there. All right, so for my CPU, guys, I got the Ryzen 7. It's the third generation. Listen, this is probably the most expensive part of the whole computer right here. This the central processing unit is literally the brains of your computer. Okay, so we're gonna install this first. A thermal paste as well for the, to put on the CPU to make sure it's not overheating and stuff like that. Scalpel. <laughs> <laughs> you see, it came with its own fan, but I bought a fan that's specifically for it. Now look how small this thing is. All of that noise for this little small piece of chip. Go, Mondo. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Give my sister the Mondo a hand. Let me start. <laughs> you gotta be careful with how you put it. That 
that will be the installation of the CPU. Got a fan for the CPU. The freezer 34. Where's the screws to? Yeah, I'm looking for so these all that two, stuff. That's to be two. So um, yeah. Now see the website I use said everything's supposed to be um, what you call it, already compatible, compatible with it. Yeah. Really? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Pass me the wrench. Want some wrench? Just nice right there. Now we got our CPU in there. Took some trial and error. Uh, the, uh, the fan that I bought for it actually didn't fit the motherboard. So I'm about to send that back. But this is the fan that the, it, it came in within the box. And we managed to get that on there right nice and tight. So now it's on to some more fun stuff. Like RAM and all that other stuff you guys love. I love the Vengeance brand. So I just kept going on with the Vengeance. These are two... Uh, Eight stick gigabytes of RAM. So I'm on the video building yours. Oh, we're doing this here. <laughs> and then I'll be the assistant. I'll pass you the scout. And this is DDR4. I wonder if you can really put the DDR3 on this motherboard. We'll have to find out the hard way. <laughs> right now, we're just gonna stick with the brand new ones. <laughs> so my old my. Cause on my old motherboard, both sides move. Wait. When is that the end of the next space? Yeah. You've been watching a lot of videos, huh? Running into a problem with the solid state drive. The SSD hard drive didn't come with a screw, but I'm seeing in the motherboard case, it has what we need. Hopefully, we don't need this later on, but. All I need is one screw right now. I believe this is uh, this is fun, isn't it? I halfway know what I'm doing, and halfway haven't done this in forever, so this is fun. And you're gonna enjoy this journey with me. But yeah, this is definitely the screw we need right here, bro. Can you put a bit on there that'll fit this little screw? There we go. Do that perfectly. Now smart look mama I'm building a computer <laughs> now I 
got the CPU in. We got the memory in. We got the solid state driving. Now it's time to start filling in the guts to the desktop. Y'all ready? And now I'm just setting up the desktop right now. Uh, picking it apart, opening up both sides so I can start entering in the guts of the desktop itself. This is the main part that we want to open up, but I want to open up this part as well because I know a lot of wires can slide in between there. And then we got, what are those things called? We got zip ties to tie the wires up so they don't get too crazy. So at the end of it all, it still look kind of pretty. This is, when it gets, this is when it gets interesting. That's when we start hooking everything up to the main part of the whole, the whole operation, you see. Look, it's kind of pretty, right? Not too bad. You took both? Yeah. No. Well, I'll say, where does the one go? Yeah. All right, you can tighten that up later. Yeah. We got the power supply. We got the power supply. We got the old hard drive. And we have. Well, the power supply and the hard drive, we could put it once we stand it up. So right now, mm. it could be the, the Wi Fi and the GPU. Yeah. It's on the other side. When we stand it up, it's from the yeah. other side. So now. What we're gonna do is put the old school GPU in because I didn't buy the, the a newer GPU. Actually, one of my friends told me he had a GPU for me, so I'll wait. But until then, we're gonna put in this old school GPU just to hold me down until then. Yeah, it has two inputs to it. I'm trying to. Yeah, Look, it fell right into it. There we go. No, it didn't. It was not Look, No, I'm good now. You sure? Mm hmm Okay. There it is. That's it. And for now, I will be rocking with the wireless because I ain't trying to run no cables through the house right now. When it's time to game, then we'll think about running wires. But for right now, we're going to do it all Wi-Fi. That's the power supply. Just that. Don't want to mess with that. Last but not least, we got the power supply. We can't turn nothing on unless we get this thing on and popping. All right, so we we got GPU in, we got CPU in, we got the ABCs in, the one, two, threes, the NAACP. Let me stop. We got everything in solid straight drive. We got the the Wi-Fi NIC card in there. Everything is in, but the power supply. So, oh, the power supply and the old hard drive. Okay, so now this is where things get a little bit more technical with all the wiring. Any screws in that box?
<laughs> Yo, that better me not be anything I need, bro. Earlier, bro, I'm gonna be tight. <laughs> I'm gonna be tight. Who's was hiding in there that whole time? Yeah, it is. I'm done. <laughs> I didn't know where this thing was. They had it hidden in the uh, hard drive slot. I was like, where are the screws at? I'm thinking they, I bought this whole thing and they give me no screws. They hit it up in there. And it, all right, I'm done. <laughs> At least we got extra, extra screws because I took the screws from my old motherboard and all that stuff. Ah, whatever. Whatever works. That's hilarious. <laughs> moments of trial and error and uh, making sure we have all the right pieces connected to the motherboard and the power supply connected to those pieces. I think we finally got it done. So, if we take a look inside, everything that I'm going to have in it right now is already in it. And uh, I'm going to push some of these cords back and do some wire management in the background and uh, just press the power button to see if this thing works at all. Yo, Jason, my man Jason Smith and Weston, you know who I'm talking to. This video is for you because I wasn't going to film this, but you said, you know what, you going to film it? And I said, all right, I'll film it for you, brothers. It is for you. First try, baby, let's go. First try. Okay, so we know the monitor works. <laughs> now let's pray that everything else works too. All right, it goes nothing. Mm -hmm. That's a good sign so far. Let's see. All right, we're gonna try this again. First time we turned the power on, uh, didn't have to have it plugged into the uh, G, uh, GPU the right way. So we're going to try this again. Let's go. I don't like the way that happened. All the way. Oh, the got to turn on the switch in the back. <laughs> All three fans going. I got windows on this memory stick right here. You better load. <laughs> That's a good sign. It's loading. It means something is happening. So as we are ready for them to get the devices ready, we are 88% right now. Just wanted to say uh, some of the things that kind of we failed on or messed up on. Uh, one of the major things is that uh, getting ready. <laughs> one of the major things is that the fan that I bought for the CPU that didn't come with the box, it didn't fit on the motherboard at all. So I got to send that back. Uh, another thing was when I first plugged in the the GPU, I didn't plug it in the correct way. That was the, that was the whole reason of you know powering up the system all over again anyway because I didn't plug that up the right, the right way uh, and I want to say the hardest part of the whole thing make sure where all the power plugged into the motherboard and connected anything to the motherboard that was a wire that that was like the hardest part so anything that's in the front display over here was pretty much tiny in this loose spot right here and it, I have to use my big fat hands to squeeze in that little spot in order to make it happen, right? And just knowing, looking at the diagram and looking at the board to make sure you had it in the right angle. But we literally got that on our first try. So, for amateurs, me and my boy Armando was holding the camera right now. We did it. We did a good job. Yeah, buddy. That's what I'm talking about. I haven't built a computer in like 
10 years, so it's all I'm all rusty. But uh put my head down and we got it done. And now I finally can go back to editing videos and everything. So I can post it on YouTube. And I, you know, if you're watching this, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh us amateurs getting it in, putting on the computer together. So the next time we have to do something like this, we won't be such I wanna say inexperienced. This is a great sign right here. Mission accomplished. So listen, thank you for watching the video. This is your boy Troy. Listen, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe already. I like to do videos on grinding and then making an income from home. Uh, this one is just something to throw in there on the side because I couldn't edit any videos. I had to fix my computer. So I'm grinding to fix my computer just so I can show you how to grind to make more income. So this is another way of grinding right now. So I'm gonna get this, I'm gonna get my life together. <laughs>